Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Asus ProArt Studio Book Pro 16 OLED W7604. To have a sneak peek at the internals of this high-end mobile workstation, you have to undo 10 Torx head screws. Since there are no gaps between the main body and the panel, the best starting point is to pop the plate with a lever tool by inserting it in the lower row of the rear exhausts. You can place a microfiber cloth below the tool if you don't want to scratch the matte surface. Then, pry the middle zone of the back and half of the sides with a thin plastic tool. After that, just lift the rear of the plate and lift it away from the chassis. If the internal clips aren't fully released, fully pry the sides and the front. This machine is equipped with a 90 watt hour battery. To remove it, slide up the small metal shroud on the top that covers the battery connector. Before doing that, wear gloves to avoid short circuits. Lift the connector on the sides with a plastic tool. Then, undo the four Phillips head screws that hold the battery in place. The capacity is enough for around six hours of video playback. Our test was conducted with the battery saver preset, activated in the Windows Power and Battery menu, and the standard mode applied in the ProArt Creator Hub app. The PCB of the Asus dial is underneath the right fan. For storage, you get two M.2 slots compatible with 2280 Gen 4 SSDs. RAID 0 configuration is available for enhanced speed. The system storage drive has a large thermal pad on top. It's still a mystery to us why the Wi-Fi 6E card is positioned in front of the left slot. As you can see, when an NVMe is installed, it almost fully covers the card on top, which could lead to potential connection problems. The memory modules are covered with heat shields. According to ASUS, the two SODIMs fit up to 64 gigabytes of DDR5, 5,200 megahertz RAM in dual channel mode. However, since the CPU can support up to 192 gigabytes, this laptop likely wouldn't have issues running a larger amount of memory than the official manufacturer's specified limit. The Asus IceCool Pro Thermal System looks massive. It features two large fans with 102 blades for each unit and pre-applied liquid metal on the CPU die. The cooling has three heat pipes shared between the CPU and the GPU and an additional one dedicated to each chip. The system is complemented by four heat sinks, two small heat spreaders, and a pair of huge metal plates. The left one also cools the chipset.